So I have not been to the shop in a while, and yeah. I just ran into CJ. What's CJ, up? how you doing, buddy? Pretty good. Can't complain. Yeah, what you got doing or going on here? Um, wow, it's all open here, man. You got rid of the blinds and whatnot? Yeah, they needed them over there. Yeah? Um, finished up both sides on this. See through there. Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah. Well, th this side was done first. Mm -hmm. um, but that side, I mean, looks exactly the right, same. Right, right. So, yeah. And then the seal, you know, sits flat on here. Right. But yeah, we can go look at that side too. Sure. I'll walk around. Yeah. Move that out just a bit and get behind you here. Yeah. Just about the same. Wow, look at that. Yeah. But yeah, it came out good. I, I sure did. They came out like almost literally exactly the same. Look at that. Everything looks so nice in there and that's going to have the yeah, the weather stripping in there. in there and yeah, just let you know, feature mm -hmm. in. Okay. Wow, looks like that's on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And then the seal runs flat mm -hmm. all the way up to here. Right. Here and there. Wow. What you got going on next with it? Um, waiting on some parts that should be some here today. Some parts, yeah. Okay, cool. But, took the bumper back off because uh, we're going to add tow hooks right here in the middle mm -hmm. on both sides. And I'm gonna weld uh, like a little bung into the front of the frame rail so you could screw a tow hook like through the bumper oh, into awesome. the frame rail. Right. Yeah. And like good uh, tie down. Mm hmm. Right. Tie down spots. Right. Awesome. Yeah, cool. so we're just waiting on that. I'm actually about to work on this thing. Are you? Yeah. What are you gonna do with that? Uh, we just put, it was having a problem uh, with the amp making this like popping noise. Mm -hmm. Why well, did diagnose that it was the amp? Just got the new amp installed and just got to tune it in and I guess make sure the temp gauge is working on it. Okay, cool. So that's what's going on with CJ this morning. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you, sir. Oh, yeah. Hey, Dom. What's going on? What's happening, Dom? Uh, I'm about to put a hole in the battery tray in this GTO. You're putting a hole in the battery tray? Yeah, the battery hold down nut popped off. Okay. So I'm going to put a nutser in its place that right. actually won't come out. Okay. So, so let's go watch Dom drill a hole. All right. Luckily, it's already here. I just kind of got to be gentle and do it. Oh, you're expanding. Yeah, I'm expanding the current hole. There it is. All right. So there is going to be the highlight of the video. That's it. <laughs> I don't even know if it's the right side. Oh no, I got to go bigger. I got to go slightly bigger. Okay, so that hole wasn't big enough, so he's got to re-drill it and drill another one. I had to step up size. He's got to step up, step it up the size. should drop right in there. Look at that. That is officially the first piece I have ever put into one of the cars. And so now where do you go? Now I'm about to break my hands trying to crimp this thing inside here. Okay. Let me uh let me blow the metal shavings out here and paint the edges. And yell at them. He was just blowing out the metal fragments from around the hole that he just put in there, and he is going to paint around the edge so that it will not rust. Mm. It requires lots of uh, finger power that I can't do by hand. Oh, hang on. Let me see if it's uh, starting to. Let me get the bigger one. They've changed the tool they were using. Nick is going to be so nice as to hold this in place while Dom puts the big kibosh on it. Yep. Here we go. Kind of... Yeah, a little easier, Dom? A little easier. It's not the hobby tool, it's the real one. <laughs> that should be it. Yep, that's it. Feels good and tight. 
Awesome. So now that that is a permanent piece in there. Right. Yeah. That is not going to come out like the other one did. Look at that. Yes, sir. There you go. Yep, mushroomed out good. Now is that that's not going to hit that other piece under there, is it? If it does, I can grind it down. Grind it down. Okay. Now it nah, I think it will be good. Right. Awesome. Nick will give it a little pre-fit here. Perfecto. All right, so we have this new tray, the new mounting bolt installed, and Dom is going to install the battery. Yes. Like that the battery's brand so it looks like a brand new battery. That it is. I don't like how the battery slides in the tray, but that'd be alright. So this is some of the high-tech stuff you see going on here at Metal Concepts. Yeah, battery, battery uh, installation, is, battery installation. Very high tech. With modification to the battery tray. Sure. Let me start that again. Hey, Thomas. How are you? Excellent. How about yourself? Very good. You got a few minutes to tell me what you're doing here? Absolutely. Awesome. What would you like to know about? There's well, a lot going on. What are you doing here today? Uh, right now, getting it prepped for the new lower control arm bushing kit. Mm hmm. When we were installing the new BC coilovers, we found some bushings that weren't very healthy. Right. So we've got a brand new urethane kit coming for that. It's got the R200 S13 diff swap, S13 axles. Mm -hmm. Wow. And then you see the new BC racing coilovers oh, all yeah. the way around. Oh yeah. Cool. Awesome. We'll final so, fit and finish on that. So is the motor all ready to go in it or? Uh, motor's already in it, it runs. Uh huh. So, so it's getting close to needing a test drive, isn't it? Pretty close. Awesome. Pretty close. Hopefully sometime next week. I won't be here next week. Right, right. But hopefully sometime next week this thing can be on the road and start putting some miles on it for us. Awesome. Cool. Thanks for the update, sir. Appreciate no, it. No worries, man. All right. So there is a quick little update here at Street Metal Concepts at the old shop. You know, keep watching because all this, all this mechanical work is going to move over to a new place. These guys are going to have a new place to put their stuff in. See you later, Dale. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thanks for watching.